I would really once again like to stress that this is a true honor for me to be standing in front of you. Uh, trust me, it took me a long time to gather all of you uh, because I was meeting basically with uh, almost every single one of you during the last uh, two months. And uh, it was happening personally and I was trying to explain uh, the project, basically what the whole China, Czech China Entrepreneurs Forum should be about. I wanted to follow what I believe in and I want to be meeting and working only with people which, has, which are having three basic characteristics. First is the work on the things, and by work I really mean work, and change the paradigm if necessary. The second uh, characteristic is uh, that I like people with personal integrity and credibility. That is very important for me. And the third thing uh, which is very important for me is trust. That's absolutely, absolutely key. Without trust, there is nothing and nothing can be achieved. And uh, I would like to introduce you the first uh, speaker of today. So please welcome Dabing Chen and thank you very much for being here today. So I advised uh, Richard and uh, Thomas to form a Czech China entrepreneur firm to lay a solid foundation before we go into business deals that still takes some time to understand each other. At least Czech and China share uh, some common uh, interests and uh, common grounds. The first uh, thing that struck me is Czech starts with a C and China starts with a C. <laughs> so let's see how this Czech China Entrepreneur Forum can do for both countries. I guess this is what I want to uh, contribute and I'm uh, ready to do whatever I can to bring the two peoples together. Thank you very much. So I would like to introduce you uh, Lord St. John, who is a member of the House of Lords of Great Britain and who is a very big expert on, on China. Well, it is a great pleasure to be here today and thank you Thomas and it's particularly pleasure to be speaking after the Bing. Uh, we have a common interest because, as you might hear by my accent, I'm not just a member of parliament in Britain, but I hail from South Africa. But it's a great treat for me to be here. It's my fifth time that I've been to Prague. It's my favourite city. It's the most romantic city in Europe. And clearly, um, I'm here delighted to be part of the opening and the launch um, of this, the Czech China Entrepreneurs Forum. Being doing business in China is no quick fix. It's all about building relationships. It's about building trust. It's about building a long-term relationship where you can work together with mutual cooperation. It's about dropping the visa restrictions, which unfortunately several countries have done with the Chinese. I have to say, this country and Prague offers everything and more for Chinese investors. I see huge, huge potential as the gateway for Central Europe. Uh, I hope I'll meet many more of you this evening. This is a great initiative. Well done to Debing, well done to Thomas, well done to Richard James, and thank you very much. I would like to invite uh, last of my three friends, Mr. Chen Gyeong Ru. Thank you very much. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Czech Republic and China, we have both have our advantages. So in recent years, um, our relations, bilateral relations, are being improved substantially, especially uh, since last year. Uh, January, uh, the new government came to power, and the sec uh, February, your president met our president in Sochi, in Russia. And then April, uh, April your, your foreign minister visited China, the foreign minister, uh, since 15 years, that visited China to make the, our relations um, uh, sustain, uh, sustainable, I mean, by signing a kind of a memorandum so in this, I conclude uh, my work. Thank you very much. So please enjoy the evening and thank you very much.